An amazing discovery will shed some light on a big part of baseball history. It's this photo of a ballpark long forgotten. And this photo may be the only one of its kind. Here's photojournalist Tony Chambers. My name is Lauren Sawasser, and I'm an associate archivist in the Photographs and Prints Department at the Missouri Historical Society. So the bulk of my job is processing collections, so I'll take incoming donations and new collections and kind of put them into some kind of order so that our researchers can use them. It's just something new every day, and you never know what you're going to find when you open a box, and it's always something new and exciting. This was exactly the box. So the Stars Park negative was in the Swakowski collection. And William Swakowski was a local dentist who was very into house histories and um, architectural history. And we suspect that the Stars Park negative was part of that historic material. So when I pulled the negative out of the box, it was completely unidentified. There was no sort of information either on the negative itself or on the envelope about what it was. I then started to do a little more digging and I noticed that there was a banner on the very front of the building and at the very bottom in small print it was blurry but it said Stars Park. My name is Paula Homan and I'm the curator for the St. Louis Cardinals Hall of Fame and Museum. The team played in Stars Park from 1922 to 1931. They won a championship in 1928 also in 30 and 31. So they had star power. Cool Papa Bell uh, is recognized by far as one of the great players. He was inducted into the National Baseball Hall of Fame as early as 1974. So on the site currently, I, I believe it's the Harris Stowe um, ball field. So it's finally able to locate in our collection uh, a photograph showing the same intersection about it. Uh, a couple of years after the stadium was torn down and from a slightly different angle but one of the buildings had kind of a unique shape to it and that building is the same in both photographs. So to be able to find something that is rare and that really does speak to people um, in a very deep way is very exciting. The St. Louis Cardinals are hoping to soon get the photo of Stars Park to display as part of their Negro League display. That collection is currently at the Cardinals Hall of Fame and Museum. That is really cool, especially with St. Louis's baseball history. All right.